Bigfoot Gill here. In this video, we're going to be talking about tank placement. Some important things to consider for tank placement is to ensure you have a level floor, that the tank is going to be out of direct sunlight to avoid the spawn of any nuisance algae, as well as heat up your tank during the summer months, access to power outlets. In my case, I have a dedicated power outlet that's on its own circuit, proper ventilation for proper oxygen exchange, as well as controlling your pH. And lastly, if you're putting your system on a second story floor, you want to ensure that the weight of that system is going to be supported by the floor underneath. Considering that the total weight of my new system is going to be roughly around 1,500 pounds with the water, the rock, the sand, the stand, the tank, and all the equipment, including the sump, it's going to come out to about 1,500 pounds. So I want to make sure this sub floor is going to be strong enough to support that weight. My house is roughly around 60 years old, so I want to make sure I have no dry rot, termite damage, or anything that would affect the integrity of the floor strength. So for that reason, I called in my contractor friend to help me out with this process. Once we opened up the ceiling downstairs, we noticed that the wood was in great condition. The contractor said it wasn't necessary to do any additional reinforcement. I also had a cross beam where the tank will be sitting on, and it's one of the main cross beams for the house, so that's going to help a lot. Since we had it all opened up, I had him do a little reinforcement anyway, just in case. But all in all, I'm very confident that my subfloor will be able to handle the weight of the tank now. Additionally, I won't have to worry about explaining any kind of accidents to my insurance company or dwell on the fact that my tank may go down one day. I know that was a very quick video, but as I prepare for the upcoming build, I want to make sure that I document as much as possible. It's also important that if you're in the market for purchasing an investment like an aquarium, that you consider the proper tank placement for the reasons stated in this video. Please take a moment to hit that thumbs up, subscribe to follow along with the upcoming build, and we'll see you guys next time.